Hey everybody, it's Hylian Alchemist, and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. In this episode, let's say we finally uh, finish off the Crystal Palace once and for all, and uh, just, you know, get this done over with, save the last Star Spirit, and, uh, you know, just hopefully be done with this game, because it's, oh god, it's been on for a long time. Who comes to my palace? And who the hell are you? Oh, it's a floating crown with uh, eyes and a robe? Where's your face? Why don't, why don't you have a face? You're, that, that, that's weird. Why is it all invisible? Mario, you finally arrived. <laughs> I know you believe you can slay the Star Spirit, but I'm afraid I won't let you. First I shall defeat you. Then I shall present Bowser with a nice Mario gift. Oh god, I'm making it sound like he's having an orgasm. I, I don't know, I have to throw it out there. So anyway, this is the Crystal King. Well, actually, no. Let's tell the Crystal Bits for a bit. <laughs> this is the Crystal Bit. We're finding the Crystal Bits first. Basically, the Crystal Bits are the, just because the Crystal King and... Max HP is one, and they're only dangerous when the Crystal King spoos them out. Their defense power is zero. These guys are pretty weak. They'll keep coming, though, until you finally beat the Crystal King. So, yes, uh, that's... Uh, actually, yeah, th th this is the Crystal King. Um, of course. Uh, well, um, you can actually just uh, knock down the um, Crystal Bits if you want to, but those, those are basically his uh, projectiles. What he'll do is that he'll just uh, swallow them, and I think he uses those to heal himself, just like Huff and Puff. But let's sell the Crystal King for a bit. Uh, he's one of Bowser's main guys. I don't know if he how he managed to take over this palace, but... Max HP is 70, attack power is 6, and defense power is 2. He'll attack you by summoning and launching crystal bits. The power of each attack is 4. The number of times he attacks equals the number of crystal bits he's deployed. He'll also try to freeze you whenever he can. When his HP gets low, he may try to divide and conquer. The power of this attack is 8. You can hurt him only by attacking his real body. If you don't know which one's the main body, you should attack all of them. Pretty brilliant, eh? Well, you know, more like his invisible invisible body because it's just a just robes, eyes, and a crown, and like there's nothing else to it. So, anyways, uh, yeah. Um, let me just say though, uh, just like just like with Huff and Puff, this this fight sucks. I mean, my, well, I mean, not not so much sucks. I mean, like pathetically easy. I mean, it's. It's not a very easy fight whatsoever, and ladies and gentlemen, this would be my second recording attempt at this, because, like, literally, I, I've had, like, two recording attempts, because, um, for one thing, I ran out of, um, I ran out of, uh, Effie trying to, trying to attack him, and then I also ran, I think I might have run out of mushrooms as well, and so I was doing so badly, and I've been having to try to use the, uh, star power to, like, well, Oh yeah, and see now I'm frozen because I failed to uh, deflect against his attack, which is why you know my timing is always off, and so I'm more likely to um, to just uh, get frozen there. So um, so one kind of strategy that you can do is that like um, you could um, whenever he has a crystal bits out, you can uh, use the one of the your uh, screen nuke attacks just by using Sushi's uh, tidal wave, or um, or if you have uh, enough star power to use the star storm, they can do, do just as well. And if uh, once you're finding the um, Crystal King himself, then um, then you can actually use Cooper to use, uh, of course, just use a fire shell against them. You know, one thing being made of ice. But yeah, that's what you can do. But yeah, because of that, I have, I'm having to use uh, so much of my uh, FP that eventually I ran out. And um, yeah, see, it's a good thing I uh, deflected or deflected it off here. But yes, yeah, so, like I actually did mention before. Um, this this fucker can actually heal himself. Yes, just like with Huff and Puff, uh, he uh, once his HP gets low, like probably about like less than 20, he actually does he can heal himself to, for about 20 HP. And like I said, I hate bosses in RPGs that heal themselves. I hate them so much. They're one of my biggest pet peeves in RPGs. See, like like that right there. He see that that, that that's what he does. That he'll just suddenly heal himself, and that's how the battle takes forever. That's one thing I really hate in RPGs is that when when enemies heal themselves and that. Takes uh, and that, that's what takes battles much longer than than it has any right to be. So yeah, make sure you're very well prepared for this fight because you know I wasn't really prepared enough. I eventually ran out of either Effie or Star Power, and so like you know I had to use as much as I can, but then he would just keep healing himself, and that's what happened. My first recording attempt is that I have uh, is that I really struggled a lot. And, uh, you know, I think I, I think I pretty much died. I, I might have died to him or so. I don't know. But, um, but yeah, because I was, or, you know, I, I think I remember. I was doing so badly that uh, I had I had to just reset the game and do a second recording attempt. 
Um, you're in the best bet if uh, one sees my soul. Like, if you do run out of your FP, if you don't have any more um, syrups or anything that heals your FP, uh, your other best bet would be uh, by using Watt and have her to um, to use her uh, electric charge or her, her, her regular attack, basically, because uh, she does do a good amount of damage against enemies. Or maybe if you have Fire Flowers, then you can just use that too, but unfortunately, I don't really have any Fire Flowers, so, um, so yeah. Um, but I actually kind of still do rely on the, uh, Scree Nuke. Or, actually, you know, you know what? I, I was actually looking for this one. Well, at least I have the Ultra Shroom, but, yeah, I did just notice I have the, um, Shooting Star that I can use. So, like, I, I, you, if you have the Shooting Star, which, uh, I would recommend you bring some with you, which you can find over around in the dungeon, then, um, then, uh, you could, um, just use that. Oh, actually, you know what? Um, the, the Shooting Star, the Star Swarm of Star Power is actually recommended when he does this. Yeah, this is where he actually uh, duplicates himself into three copies, and because, uh, you know, unfortunately, guys, it is so hard to tell which is the real one, and so because of that, um, I think what happens is that if you hit the wrong one, then um, you just, um, you probably just get attacked afterwards. So, yeah, this is actually where you would really want to use any one of the screen nuke attacks, like either the shooting stars or if you use a star storm. Because there is no way to tell whatsoever which is the real uh, Crystal King. It's actually a lot similar to the, um, well, a lot similar to the uh, first uh, Cacleta fight in uh, Superstar Saga, where, like, she duplicates herself, and so it's also hard to tell which is a real one, and so um, you might have to use, like, I don't know, something to, to just, uh, find another real one. But yeah, that's 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 what it entails here. So he's doing that again, so I think this is where I finish a mob with the shooting star if I'm not mistaken. No, okay, yeah, he only has two HP left, but yeah, this is where we can finish him off, hopefully, if he doesn't... Okay, yeah, good. He doesn't heal himself, so let's finish him off. And then, there we have it. And now Crystal King is down. Once and for all. That was a tough fight, but we did it. And so that's... We got a level up, of course, for one thing. And now that the, um, oh, you know what, um, I, I just saw there, uh, oh no, the last Star Spirit came, Bowser, forgive me! Yeah, I just saw right there that, um, that there's no more, uh, upgrade to, uh, get into the, uh, badge points, but yeah, the maximum capacity for a badge points is 30, so I think the next level I'll do just that. So, with that, the Crystal King is down, and now, ladies and gentlemen, at long last, all of the, um, all the bosses have been, have been defeated, and so... Since we have, like, uh, six uh, Star Spirits, and now we just have one more. And there it is. The last Star Spirit. Let's slowly walk with it, because that's how I am. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we did it. Not only have we reached the end of the chapter, but now we have our last and final Star Spirit. All seven of them. End of chapter indeed. Take it away, Morgan Freeman. Mario has saved the last Star Spirit Kalmar from the Crystal Palace at the edge of the world. Now, with the seven Star Spirits together, he has the power to challenge Bowser and the Star Rod. At last, it is time for Mario's showdown with Evil King Bowser. Can Mario rescue Princess Peach and recover the Star Rod, or will wishes forever go ungranted? We may never know ourselves. Also, sorry for the sun delay right there. I had a lot of stuff coming up. I really do apologize, but... Anyway, last feature in the loot, and yeah, this is where it's all cutscenes and we can't control her. Oh, Mario, I wonder what he's doing now. I wish I knew if I was helping him at all. Of course you are. Mario will be fine. You should, proud of, you should be proud of your efforts. Mario knows all you've done. And don't you worry, Princess. You'll be able to talk to him in person before long. <laughs> I hope you're right, Twink. Thanks for cheering me up. Let's go back to the room, shall we? No, it's too bad we can't do any more Metal Gear. Oh, hello there, Mr. President. Oh, Princess Peach! Your cuddly old Bowser's here! Can't we have a friendly conversation for a change? Come on, let me see a smile! I have nothing to say to you! Oh, don't be such a pill! You're stuck with me for a long, long time, beautiful! You'd better get used to it! My 
Mario is coming, Bowser, and you can't stop him! <laughs> oh, you poor silly girl! I'm invincible with a star rod, didn't you know? Mario's no match for me! This history, get over it! Your raunchiness! We have an emergency! Raunchiness? Oh, what is Bowser doing with his ears? Uh, better be important. I'm right in the middle of a friendly chat with the princess. Uh, Mario has now saved all the star spirits. There is a chance he could come here using their power. We must make ourselves ready in case he shows up. What? Uh, Mario! Okay, listen, Captain Koopa. Send everyone to their posts. We'll ambush him the second he enters my castle. Princess Peach, why don't you come with me to watch? You can have a front row seat to see Mario get crushed. You, yeah you, tie her up immediately. If she gets on this time, heads will roll. Goddamn, Bowser, wow. No, please! You big Koopa, show some respect to the princess. What is this whiny little glittering thing? Confetti? Ugh, buzz off! It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Tweak! Take the princess! Now! Let's move! No! Did Gabby Cooper just call him because he was watching this? What was <gasps> I think I know the theories of Super Mario Sunshine! Anyway, my name is Kalmar. Mario, well done. Thank you for coming. You have successfully rescued all of us Star Spirits. We are in your debt. Now all that is left is for you to challenge Bowser. My power should help you. To bring back the Star Rod, to beat Bowser, to bring peace back to the Mushroom Kingdom, and to save Princess Peach. And let's see what the final uh, star power is going to be. Mario Star Energy goes up to 7. Mario can now use up and away a new Star Spirit power. With up and away, you can turn all enemies into stars. Uh, it's actually uh, an alternative to run away, basically. Mario, you must make your way back to sh back to Shooting Star Summit. From Shooting Star Summit, we'll prepare the route to Star Haven. The name of this route is Star Way. Once, tra once you travel the Star Way, you'll finally reach Star Haven. My only wish is for you to save the precious world. You can do it, Mario. Goodbye for now. So yeah, with uh, with up and away, basically, uh, it you know it basically just ends a battle. It's not really useful. I mean, you do have the option to run away, although uh, it is actually a way to just uh, do that without having to waste any coins. But it does drain away star power anyway. But you know, whichever way you want to do. If you want to, if you want to save your coins, you can use that. But you know, if you don't want to waste any star power, then I guess you're gonna spend your coins running away. But with that, we did it, guys. We finally did it. We've saved all the star spirits. We've um, we've done it. We're pretty much we're almost done with the game. And so all that's left is to go to Shooting Star Summit, and then we uh, reach up to Bowser. Now, of course, even though we've done all that, that does not mean, of course, yeah, you guess it, guys. What we always do after each chapter is done. We still have a lot of uh, we still have some claims to do, of course. Yeah, there's going to be some stuff that we had to that, that I do want to cover before uh, before we get to the final showdown because uh, once uh once we beat the game, then like uh, there's not really any uh, post game to cover. But so like so what I'm going to do is that um, before we uh, before we head out, uh, we're just going to go ahead and just you know clean up the rest of the stuff that we haven't done just yet, uh, just by you know getting any uh, remaining of the uh, any of the remaining star pieces or like doing letter deliveries and doing some more uh, you know. That's uh, something I might not have covered. And also, uh, there's actually one last thing which I do want to uh, save for just like the, you know, you know just uh, save one video for to finish up the rest. And it's going to be a long one, but, you know, we'll just get to that eventually. You know, just all, all for the sake of just, you know, making sure everything's done and ready to go before we head to the final showdown. But yeah, that's uh, that's what's going to be our agenda for uh, the next uh, couple of episodes. And so, uh, so yeah. So I'll catch you guys uh, for next time on Let's Play Paper Mario. We're going to be covering that. So until next time, see you guys later.